I'm Justin Montgomery, one of the instructors. It's really neat how the course is set up. It takes the students from a very concept-driven approach where we work with simpler integrated development environments and they start with MIT Scratch, for example. They learn the thought process behind coding like loops, for example, and global variables. And then we get into Python, which is an industry-grade programming environment and that's when they get into the details. So the way Project Lead the Way sets up the curriculum, you could really see the progression very clearly. One of the things that students can look forward to is in Scratch, they will invent either a game on a computer or they'll invent something that's more of like a storyline or an RPG where it's a role-playing game. And students got really excited about that this year and they had 100% control over the storyboard and the creation of it in programming. I wasn't exactly sure what I was getting into, but um, all I knew that was that I was interested in computer science, and um, the work's definitely fun and interesting, and um, it's definitely helping me out with my computer science. Like, I thought it was going to be a little more difficult to retain information, but like, from what they've been giving us and how they've been teaching us, I've been able to retain the information when using other pieces of the program. I've been able to implement what I've learned from earlier on in the year, and be able to use it now. When we came in, I figured it would be like a lot harder, but it wasn't. So we started out very simple with very basic things, and then we worked our way up, which was good. So we all got a basic understanding first, and then we built off that. My experience has been great. I, um, I learned a lot. We learned how to code in Python and Scratch and the basis of like what the things mean, and um, I think it's going to really help my future. What I'm excited to get into was um, like the GUI's graphical user interface, what we're learning here now, like like the iPhone and like using that. It's also um, robotics. Like I really like the mechanicals of using code and then implementing it for some type of object or mechanical device. So my goals in the long term would be to learn how to learn about cybersecurity and how we can prevent hacking with using firewalls and how to build video games using C++. Using any device, like your tablet, your iPad, you actually see where, you can actually tell how the people implemented the code and tell like how they lead on to one another and how like you can actually relate to what you're using, which I find that pretty cool. The expectations are high in that they keep up with their good time management skills, that they continue to apply themselves to learning the different types of programming related topics that they'll learn. What's really nice is there is a lot of hands-on work and a lot of individualized attention and teachers are available throughout the day to help students complete tasks and it's also a really good program because of the content that a student will learn is going to be relevant no matter what field they go into. The expectations I have for students as they move through the curriculum is that they'll continue to engage with the content and building their repertoire of a vast understanding of the programming world. 